Hello, how are you today? I'm great, how are you, baby? I am doing great, it's so great to be back at DragCon. I was here last year, so have you been in the past? I have never been to the New York one um, and the LA one, so this is my first time, first time ever doing it. Wow. RuPaul's gonna kill me when she hears this. <laughs> it's fine, yeah. it's fine. I mean, at least you're here now, right? Exactly, I mean, you get to meet people from all over the world. I mean, mostly importantly, um, five-year-olds, six-year-olds, seven-year-olds, 11-year-olds, I mean, Drag has become such a phenomenon. It has reached out to much younger people that before to get to see a drag show or a drag queen, the only way to see them was to go to a gay bar. Now they're everywhere into your own TV screen. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and I love how popular the show has become just now being on BH1 and uh, partnering with World of Wonder to put on events like this that are, you know, exactly. actually officially sponsored by the show to begin exactly. with. Exactly. I mean, so much more exposure than it was before. Like I said before, 10 years ago, before Drag Race, the only way to get to see a drag show was at a gay bar. Now, it's everywhere. Mm -hmm. Everywhere. I, and I love seeing it everywhere. Hamburger Mary's has great drag shows. I don't exactly. know if you've been there, yes, but yes. or I, if you participated. I will participate. be there tonight, actually. <gasps> really? Yeah. The Long Beach location. Yeah. I will be there. Oh and tomorrow God. I will be there as well again. And yeah, love it there. Amazing. Oh, okay, well, if you ever perform at the one in WeHo, I'd love to come out I and see your show. I was just there yesterday. You just missed it, girl. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm sorry. I go to bed at like 8, though, so if it was the nighttime one, I'm sorry. I was sleeping. <laughs> it's okay, we know you're 12, so. Yeah, I, yeah, I'm 12. I have a bedtime. My parents. How old are you, really? I'm actually, guess. I won't be offended. Just say it. 21. 21? Girl, you better work, girl. I do. See? I do. You better work, girl. <laughs> so, um, you were, of course, on this past season. Yes. Um, how was. Current season. Yes, uh, current season. That's what I meant. I'm sorry. <laughs> Clearly, I didn't get enough sleep. <laughs> season 10. Um, how has it been being here? Have people come up and, like, said anything specifically about your their favorite um, performance of yours? Or? Um, I. You know, before Drag Race, the only way um, and venue that I get to perform in were in New York. So Drag Race changed my life dramatically, that I get to go to places I've never been to before. So without Drag Race, I would still be in New York City scrolling through Facebook or Instagram looking at other people's fabulous lives. So now they're looking at my fabulous yes. life. Isn't that amazing? Yeah, I think it's yeah. amazing. And the glitter just makes it even Thank more I love your glitter too. Thank you. I, I'm obsessed yeah. with glitter. <laughs> <laughs> glitter girls, hashtag yes. glitter girls. Yes. I think that's cute, but girls with a Z. I yes. don't know why that sounds a bit girls. cooler. Girls. girls, yes, exactly. <laughs> so, um, thank you so much for your interview. Thank you for having me. I'm so happy that thank you were you. able to make it out this year. Um, thank you. We hope to see you in future years. For everyone to keep up with um, new shows you have, and hopefully the next time you're at Hamburger Mary's here, can you um, plug your Instagram and Twitter? Sure, Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. Yuhua Hamasaki. Thank you for making them all the same. That makes it a lot easier. <laughs> of course, of course. Thank you. Of course, thank you, and enjoy the rest of the con. Thank you. Happy Dracon Day. Yes. Bye, guys.